Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a two minute Tuesday which is a series of product reviews that I've got up on my channel. Now the product that I'm going to be reviewing for you today is from the brand Palmer's and this is their Coconut Oil Moisture Grow Hairdress. Now I got this from Sainsbury's for £3 but you can get it from Superdrug I think for £3.29. Now I've got to admit that I mistakenly took this for a hair mask. I used a coconut hair mask by Palmer's that I got in one of my subscription boxes and I really liked it and so when I was doing my online shop I thought I will do a little search and see if they've got the Palmer's hair mask. So I did a search for Palmer's and coconut because it was the coconut oil hair mask that I had used and this popped up. And I thought, right, I will give that a go. And yeah, it's not a hair mask. So what the little tub says is that it is specifically formulated for very dry, kinky or curly hair. And that the formula may not be appropriate for finer hair types, but you apply a pea-sized amount to clean dry hair and scalp and you do not rinse. So what the Sainsbury's website says about this is that the coconut oil strengthens and adds shine, the monoy oil deeply nourishes and repairs, the olive oil conditions the scalp and controls frizz, and the vitamin E will help protect against damage. And so yeah, all good things. I thought I will give it a go. And the actual uh, product is a... Um, a hard substance and so it's solid in there and so I took a small amount out of the tub so just a little pea-sized amount and then I rubbed it between my fingers so that it turned into more of an oily um, product and I then went on to massage this into my uh, roots and onto my scalp and that's where it started to go a little bit wrong. I thought that a pea-sized amount wasn't enough for doing my whole head and my whole scalp and so I just focused on the roots that you can actually see so I went into these roots here I also did the roots on the side of my head as well and I also did a little bit underneath as well but I left that on overnight and then I washed my hair the following morning and then when I was blow drying it I noticed that my hair looked and felt so greasy all my roots just looked really dark and like they were all sort of like together um, and so it just it just felt so greasy and it just weighed my hair down and it looked awful if I'd have had time I would have washed my hair again before I went out but unfortunately I didn't have time and so I went out and luckily for me the weather wasn't that great and so I did have my rain hood up quite a lot of the time when I was out and about but yeah there was times when I had my hood down and my hair looked so awful and I would definitely not use this again. The fact that it says that it is for very dry kinky or curly hair and that it may not be appropriate for finer hair I did think yes I have got fine hair but I've got an awful lot of it and so I thought maybe it would be okay. On the Superdrug website it does say that it is for dry damaged or colour treated hair which I have got. I have got colour treated hair, the ends of my hair are really dry although I didn't use this on the ends, I just used it on my roots and on my scalp as well but yeah it just looked awful and it, it, it was okay to rinse out, I 
washed it again that evening when I came in and it did wash out absolutely fine the second time but um, yeah it's just definitely not for people with straight fine hair. Now when I went and had a look on the reviews some people did like using this, people with curly hair liked how it defined their curls there was also a, a lady on there with afro hair and she said that it was really good for her afro hair but yeah it's definitely not one for people with straight fine hair because it just makes your hair look greasy and weighed down so that's it from me and my two minute tuesday i hope you enjoyed this review if you did please give it a big thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed yet to my channel then please do subscribe because it really would mean a lot to me and also leave me a comment as well down below if you have used the um coconut oil moisture grow hairdress because yeah I would love to know other people's experiences with this product but yeah thank you ever so much for watching and hopefully I will see you in my next video all right then thank you bye